A lot of us like to build our pneumatic launchers or air cannons out of plastic pipe because it's readily available and easy to work with. However, not all plastic pipe is created equal, and I've heard many times on the internet that you shouldn't use uh, ABS or anything called DWV, or especially your cellular core when you're making uh, up an air cannon. What I have here is a piece of one and a half inch uh, ABS cell core, as you can clearly see marked on it. I've made up a uh, air chamber with it, two end caps cemented on. The cement's been allowed to dry for a full 24 hours. I've got an air chuck on it, and I'm going to attempt to burst this with my uh, high-pressure air compressor. We'll see what happens to this uh, cellular core ABS one and a half inch. Well, everything's set up and ready to go. I've got the pressure gauge showing in the top left corner of the frame, so I think I'm uh, ready to start this uh, cell core ABS experiment. Well, let's give this a shot. Compressor on, pressure building. Okay, at first, shut off the compressor, let's recover things and check out the damage. Here's an overview of the uh, burst damage. The uh, pipe itself failed, obviously. The uh, end caps were not impaired in any way, although the burst occurred right up the bottom end of the uh, sample pressure chamber that I'd made. Here's a closer view of the burst damage. You can uh, clearly see the uh, air bubble structure in uh, the wall of the pipe. Makes the pipe lighter and cheaper, but uh, not necessarily terribly strong.
What surprised me in this test with this one and a half inch cellular core DWV ABS pipe is that with this particular sample, it took uh, about 455 psi to burst this and cause the damage I'm showing right now. So it was surprisingly strong. But on the other hand, this test was done indoors, cool temperatures, uh, it's about uh, 67, 68 degrees Fahrenheit inside here right now, uh, where I've done the test. If this was outside uh, in the sun and hot, it probably wouldn't have been as strong. Interesting result, anyway, that for one and a half inch it took about 455 psi to burst this uh, cellular core DWV. Well, that's all for this test. Thanks for watching, and hopefully that was interesting and informative. There'll be more to come.